Today it's WWE 2K20, but I can only draft former Intercontinental Champions to my roster in Universe Mode. Remember, if you do go on to enjoy this video, make sure to subscribe because over half of you aren't. Leave a like and comment down below as usual. I don't know why I almost messed that up, but with that all being said, let's get into the Universe Mode and see who really is the workhorse with this title. Who's the best former Intercontinental Champion? Even though there is one current champion in there, that is the Intercontinental Champion, but you'll see what I mean. Alrighty, as you can see, give me a second, um, I decided to go with the white strapped version of the IC title just because I, I don't know man, it it does something to me. It, it I, I don't know how to explain it, but it just, whenever I see this, that, ugh. I know that sounds pretty sus, but yeah, I just decided to go with the white strap because I like it a lot. It's my favorite version of the IC title, and I currently have Nakamura holding it because in real life, he is the Intercontinental Champion as King Nakamura. I'm surprised he's not in the King of the Ring, to be honest, because, you know, he's the, the King or whatever, but yes, we got Nakamura, and I'm going to show you the roster right now, so here we go. As you can see, there is a lot of people on this roster, so I'm just going to run down it very quickly. We've got... Seth Rollins, Drew McIntyre, Dolph Ziggler, The Miz, Big E, Sami Zayn, Apollo Crews, Shawn Michaels, Randy Savage, uh, Ricky Steamboat, and Razor Ramon. Hopefully, this is going to be a banger of a video because these are all basically workhorses of the company. Um, along with, I don't know, Apollo Crews is there. Uh, nothing against Apollo Crews. He just had a really short reign, didn't he? He didn't do much with it, so... That kind of sucks. Well, I'll be going pay-per-view to pay-per-view, by the way. This is just like a sim of, like, pay-per-view to see who's the champion at the end. And if we get to WrestleMania, I'm pretty sure we will. I will watch the WrestleMania match for the IC title. Just because that'll be a cool way to end the video. But here we go. We're on the SmackDown now. Oh, we got Nakamura versus Razor Ramon. Okay. Randy Savage, Apollo. Miz and Sami Zayn. Drew and Big E. Michaels and Ricky Steamboat. Main event, Seth Rollins versus Dolph Ziggler. Bangers, you remember the IC title match they had? SummerSlam and like other places where Ambrose came back and all that, you know. Absolute, absolute, just, oh. Well, let's say it's just simulate. I'm going to predict Seth Rollins walks out with his victory right now. He does. I, I'm a god. Like, what, what can I, I nah, no, it's just, you know, Seth's a high overall in the game, so. Wait, why is there only three matches? That's kind of weird. But we got Sami Zayn versus Razor Ramon. Dolph Ziggler. Gets to verse Shinsuke Nakamura. Okay, so it's not Rollins, even though Rollins stomped your head. Maybe there was shenanigans going on in the upper, other weeks I didn't see. But, what's the main event? It's the Money in the Bank ladder match. Okay, we got The Miz, Seth, Drew, Sean, Big E, Ricky Steamboat, The Macho Man, and Apollo Crews. Looking bland. I don't know, but here we go. Let's see. We'll just simulate it here. Razor Ramon gets the win over Sami Zayn. Who's the new Intercontinental? Is there a new Intercontinental Champion? Nakamura retains. Okay. Nakamura is retained. But he has to look out for... Whoa. Seth Rollins wins money in the bank anyway. He didn't need the title shot, I guess. So that's cool. Hopefully he cashes it. Imagine if he holds it all year and cashes it in at WrestleMania. Real life shit. Like, that's some real life... Man... You already know. The Miz versus Apollo Crews. There's only four matches on this. I don't know why. Usually it's like more, but I guess it's because there's 12 people on the roster. Apollo Crews versus The Miz. Dolph Ziggler versus Randy Savage. Rollins versus Nakamura. He's Mr. Money in the Bank. So that's cool. What's the main event then? A fatal four-way for the main event for some reason. Not with the IC title on the line, so... Yep. It's kind of like real life, but... Who's going to win? Seth Rollins or Nakamura? Nakamura retains against Mr. Money in the Bank. But we all know that Seth is like, he's coming. Unless he cashed in already. I don't know. I've turned the sliders up all the way for that. So, I guess we'll have to see. Extreme Rules has come around, baby. Let's go. Sami Zayn versus Shawn Michaels. I almost said Shinsuke Nakamura. NXT. Uh, Apollo Crews versus The Miz. Drew McIntyre versus Big E. Extreme Rules match. Seth Rollins versus Shinsuke Nakamura. They're running it back. Mr. Money in the Bank still. He didn't cash in. I checked it. Like, he hasn't cashed in yet. Ooh. Main event. Dolph versus Randy Savage. Loki is slapper. Not gonna lie. But, 
who's walking out with a title. I feel like it's going to be Seth this time. Seth loses again, bro. Yo, Nakamura is unstoppable as the IC champion. It's like real life. Biggest party of America summer, not me because I'm Australian, lol. <laughs> Fatal 4 way to start it out. Apollo Crews versus Shawn Michaels. Now that is a slapper right there. Apollo, I'll give you that. Razor Ramon versus Randy Savage. What's the main event? Triple threat match. Shinsuke Nakamura, the champion, Drew Big Daddy McIntyre. Full man and Connell champion held that oval version, sexy as hell, as well. And Seth freaking Rollins, Mr. Money in the Bank. But who is going to be coming the champion right now? Is Nakamura going to retain? Or is the triple threat rules, I can't even speak, going to play into effect? Let's have a look. Drew McIntyre is your new Intercontinental Champion right now in this Universe Mode Sim. God damn it, Drew. Big Daddy. What did he say? <laughs> Dolph versus The Miz. Absolute slappers as always. This is Hell in a Cell, by the way. Big E versus Sami Zayn. We've got a lot more matches on this card, by the way, for some reason. Apollo Crews versus Shawn Michaels again. Nakamura versus Ricky Steamboat. Damn, Nakamura getting pushed out of it. Randy Savage versus Razor Ramon. Surely the main event is out of Hell in a Cell match. Rollins versus Drew McIntyre for the Intercontinental Championship. Who is going to come out on top, honestly? I don't really know because I really want Drew to win just to retain it. But I feel like Seth is winning right now. He's Mr. Money in the Bank as well, so he can have that as well. But who's going to win, Seth or Drew? Drew McIntyre retains against Seth. Freaking rolling. Super showdown at the MMG, I think it was. I can't remember. It was, it was in Melbourne. Lol, they're not doing good right now. <laughs> Shawn Michaels versus Ricky Steamboat to start us off. Sami Zayn versus Dolph Ziggler. Slappers, obviously. No holds barred match. Biggie versus Seth Rollins for some reason. That's cool. Nakamura versus Randy Savage. And the main event is The Miz. One of, I believe, the best IC champions in a hot minute, The Miz, taking on Drew McIntyre for the white strap, as always. The Miz versus Drew McIntyre. Who is getting the win in this match? Maurice is there, so she might play a factor. Let's see. Drew McIntyre keeps retaining the title. The Miz is a formidable opponent, to be honest, with the IC division, but Drew Big Daddy McIntyre retains the title once again. And honestly, I'm... I'm gonna. I'm not gonna be surprised if he actually carries it to WrestleMania when we watch the match. So I mean, that's a pretty stacked team. Not gonna lie, for like both sides, but we are focused on the IC title. Can the Miz beat Drew McIntyre right now? Let's see. He beats the. As I said, I thought Drew was gonna hold the strap till Mania. So when we watch him, he's got the strap. But the Miz, one of the best IC champions in a hot minute, probably in like the 2010s, beats Drew McIntyre. For the championship. Shawn Michaels versus Randy Savage in a ladder match. No title on the line though. That kind of sucks. We're probably going to see a TLC match right here. Mystical Brain. As you know, I am very psychic and it always works. Let's see. Oh my god, it's a TLC match. Who would have thought? TLC in the pay-per-view name. TLC match. Seth Rollins versus The Miz. Honestly, we're not be surprised if Rollins wins it right now. As The Miz just drops it immediately. But Miz... Rollins, let's go. The Miss, as I said, the Miss loses. God damn it, this is like Bobby Lashley with the championship. I can't lie, that's that's kind of funny. But Seth Rollins, Mr. Money in the Bank still, I believe. I mean, I can check it after this. We are going to see if my man Rollins still has the briefcase. He still does. Oh my God, look, look at that shit. Look at him, man. The Miz getting a rematch against Seth Rollins. They might be in a rivalry though, so that's probably why. Royal Rumble, 10-man Royal Rumble. Obviously, there's 12 people in this sim. So two people are missing out. That's actually kind of ass. I wonder who actually misses out, but let's see. Can The Miz retain? Oh, not retain. Win back the championship from Seth Rollins. He loses again. Damn, the, Seth Rollins is actually going to hold this forever. But who is the Royal Rumble winner? I mean, it won't show us here, which sucks. But we're going to have to check the news right now. Let's see. Ba -la -la, give me a drum roll. Editor Steve, put in a drum roll for God's sake. I hope you do. But who's the Royal Rumble winner? Big E has won the Royal Rumble. Ayo, WWE champion in real life. Was Intercontinental champion first. 
Always remember that. Oh, we're starting with the Elimination Chamber. What's the main event? It's just another chamber match without the title. What? Why is Alistair Black in this universe mode right now? Nonetheless, we're just going to ignore that. We've got the Intercontinental Championship on the line. First out of the two matches here, The Miz versus Seth Rollins, Shawn Michaels, Drew McIntyre, Nakamura, and Macho Man Randy Savage. We've got The Miz, Drew McIntyre, and Nakamura, all former IC champions in this universe sim alone. So that's pretty funny. But who's going to walk out as the champion? It's currently Seth Rollins. So let's go in three, two, one. Ooh, The Miz wins back the strap in the chamber. Life in the fast lane. Yeah, we're going now. In it, in it. I don't know the words. <laughs> but we got Nakamura versus Apollo Crews. Randy Savage versus Dolph Ziggler. We, we don't care about this anymore. It's towards the end of the video. Triple threat match. Nak oh, Nakamura. I keep thinking it's Shawn Michaels is Nakamura because I'm like, sure. He, he does. Okay. The Miz is a, he's a, he's a demon. He's on demon time. He runs on that demon time right now. The Miz going to WrestleMania, it appears, as the Intercontinental Champion. And, and I wouldn't have it any other way, man. As I said, he's really good. So, wait, we're not even getting it as the main event. That's kind of cheeks. But Big E, the Royal Rumble winner with his New Day brethren there for some reason. I mean, Big Kofi is a former Intercontinental Champion. I feel like Woods should have it as well. Like, oh, the WWE title in real life. WWE, you know what to do. But well, we got The Miz as the champion to close this out. Big E. The Miz. Let's get it on. Here we go. Xavier's got the trombone as it's Big E versus The Miz. Oh, Miz. Oh. Neckbreaker. Rude Awakening. That's a former... In in I can't speak right now. That's a former Intercontinental Champion right there in Rick Rude. But here we go. We got The Miz and Big E. Not even the main event, which sucks. But the headlock takedown. Punched by The Miz. Oh, my God. I think the Miz is left-handed, so that's gonna be pretty effective. My my PS4 is sounding oh punched by the Miz. My PS4 is sounding like it's taking off. I apologize if you can hear it. The Miz with the abdominal stretch. Kofi looking fly. Xavier got the trombone out. I swear to God, Big E wins. You're gonna hear that thing all day. Why did I do that? That that that, that, that it it didn't look right. Maurice is in the corner of the oh my God, Lariat by Big E, and he goes for the pin. Not even a one. As I said, Maurice is in the corner of the Miz, so she must play a factor, obviously, in these matches if he's retaining all the time. Oh, Big E! Bulldog by the Miz! I have never seen that reversal in my life to a Big E back body drop that he used to have as a signature in 2K14. Rude Awakening yet again. Xavier put down the trombone. Did you see that? He's He means business, man. As Miz is going for a pin. One. Only a one count. Where is... I thought Xavier was going to go get, like, get the stairs or something, or, like, a chair. Oh, he's cheering. Oh, oh, backbreaker. He's not going to drop him yet, though. Second one drops him to the floor. Let's go. Reversal by The Miz. Oh, big clubbing punch by Big E. And he's going to ragdoll The Miz again with backbreakers. This is going to set up perfectly for the big ending, which is more towards, like, hurting the stomach and all that. I still don't know how it works as a finish, because Big E is falling on his back as well, but... We don't talk about that. Belly to belly! The Miz almost hit his head on the mat. That is some dangerous shit right there. That's all I... I've been saying that word a lot. I apologize. But as you see, we hype right here. Snap DDT to Big E. It might be it. Oh, it, it, might, it must be a signature. One, two. Only a two count on Big E. That's cool. Honestly, I don't know who I want to win in this match. I love both of these guys, so... But the Miz is just goaded. Oh, he, I think he might have been going for the Skull Crusher finale. Big E. Oh, I thought he was going to go for the big ending, bro. He's pre Oh, my God. Big E. Excuse that, what I was saying. Big E. Yo. Three and a half minute 95. Big ending. Are we going to have a new champion? One. Two. Three. Big E. Ends this video as the new intercontinental champion. The WWE champion in real life gets the strap in this universe sim. He has held the white strap version of the Intercontinental title, by the way. So, this is kind of perfect. It was the first title he held on the main roster. So, let's go, Big E, bro. Yeah, look at the big man with the icy strap at WrestleMania, bro. This was real life, but he lost it. 
to Apollo Crews, to uh, Commander Aziz. But Big E, bro, gets the win over The Miz. You love to see it. But Big E ends this video as the Intercontinental Champion of the... I don't know why I, I can't say Intercontinental properly sometimes, but there you go. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to subscribe and leave a like and comment as always. It's been Steve and Big E. He got that white strap on, baby. See you later. I'm not talking about that. <laughs>